Hey, my name is Keith and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you for joining me. Today we are making copycat Chick-fil-A nuggets. Or attempting to, I should say. <laughs> First, we start by taking our boneless, skinless chicken breast and cutting it up into cubes. They should look a little bit something like this. They don't have to be perfect though. Now we toss it directly into our shake box. And wash our hands because salmonella is a real thing. This recipe called for pickle juice. It didn't tell me to spill it everywhere, but I did that anyway. So I took a cup and a half of pickle juice to marinate the chicken with with a little bit of salt and now we shake it up just to get it completely marinated and then you throw it in the refrigerator for 30 minutes even though the chicken didn't come in direct contact with the cutting board we still want to wash it just to be safe now we move on to our homemade potato fries i have no idea how to make waffle fries so i'm not even going to attempt we just gonna make old-fashioned cut fries i didn't know until i was like 18 that french fries were literally just cut up potatoes but it's literally that simple but make sure you wash it just in case somebody at trader joe's was touching all over your potato this is a very important step. I like to dry mine off with paper towel. You want the more dry potato is, the crispier they come out in the air fryer. I season mine with black pepper, salt, garlic salt, and onion powder. A little bit of olive oil, and a teaspoon or two of baking powder. This helps the fries to get super crispy in the air fryer. It should look a little something like this. It's completely coated. But I gotta interrupt this video to tell you, I got a package from Vital Proteins. This is the best company to pair with during this season. Not only is COVID spiking in a lot of states, we are still in flu season. Vital Protein offers an array of products to boost your immune system during the season. I'm gonna try one of the recovery drinks on camera just so y'all can see that it's actually really tasty. So while you're helping yourself, you're getting a really good drink on top of that. You know it's good, I had to go in for a second sip. They also have these defense shots, which is turmeric, pineapple, and lime. Not only does it help ward off a common cold, it tastes amazing at the same time. So make sure you go check out Vital Proteins to get your own today. Not a sponsor. <laughs> now it's time to move on to our wet mixture. We grab one egg with some salt and pepper and whisk it up. I like to use this vegan chicken this seasoning from Trader Joe's. It's kind of like a chicken bouillon season basically. About a teaspoon of each seasoning and then whisk it up. Then you grab a teaspoon of powdered sugar, salt and garlic powder. Some black pepper, a little bit of chili powder. Toss all that in the bowl and get to mixing. These fries came out amazing by the way. <laughs> but now it's just like frying chicken. You go dry mixture, wet mixture, dry mixture. That way the chicken is completely coated. Living my life like it's golden. Living my life like it's golden. Living my life like it's golden. 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 Come on, are you really cooking if you're not singing? But me and my wife had a New Year's resolution to not cuss. And I taped this video an hour before midnight on New Year's Eve. Safe to say, I don't think that she's gonna do well. But you watch it and you tell me how long you think that resolution is gonna last. Viewer discretion advised, parents. It ain't even midnight yet. You ain't heard them sirens? Nigga, we hear that shit every day in the hood. Punk ass nigga. It's almost 12 o'clock, so you better get ready for your confessional. I'ma do what the hell I'm gonna do. It's almost 12 o'clock, so you better get ready for your confession. Stop doing that. I don't want to do Fuck, nigga! And why are you doing whatever you want to do? Get ready for that confession. It ain't midnight, so I'm gonna cuss like a sailor. Uh, get this paper. Well, you don't seem like a changed person if you ask me. You know what? You said no cussing. And you already cussing. You're lucky it's not midnight yet. As soon as midnight hit. Since midnight, we better shut your ass up. <laughs> <laughs> you doing terrible. What's your new New Year's resolution? Me? Yeah. I'm not saying it out loud this year. Okay, every time I say it out loud, it don't get done. So if I just keep low, mind my business, drink my water, everything gonna happen the way I want it to. I'm not saying that out loud, for real. Because it never goes my way when I do that. You think it's because you're saying it out loud? That's why I don't really? Yeah, or something. Like, I, it's like, I don't know, reverse psychology or something. I say it out loud, then the universe be like, bitch, you thought. Well, first off, you need to stop cussing. I'll tell you what I'm on. I want to be happy no matter what. Every day I want to find a reason to smile. 
Didn't you just say that the only reason you weren't telling me is because you think I'm backfire? No, but that, that should have been the main one you kept to you, to yourself. No. That's the most important one. No, that one not gonna. What's more important than happiness? That one's all come naturally. But yeah, so what's yours? To live my life like it's golden. Okay, next. <laughs> But if I had to I had to pick a New Year's resolution, it would be to stop doubting myself. Okay. But I don't, I don't know what that got to do with the New Year's. Let yourself go. Go to your highest being. So when you doubt yourself, you're knocking yourself down a few inches. You know? Because you're not letting yourself reach your full potential. Sometimes you got to look at things the way you don't want to look at things. You gotta hurry up because I keep eating those fries. <laughs> you weren't supposed to be. <laughs> what? You weren't supposed to be over here. Bro, you're not supposed to be over there. No, I'm looking in here. But as I said before, you toss in the air fryer at 375 for 15 minutes, and then you flip halfway and cook another 10 minutes. But it's safe to say these did not come out the way it's supposed to. So I got Taco Bell. <laughs> but please give it a try and tell me how it works for you. God bless you. Wait, did I introduce myself? 